Newsflash, did you know Bitcoin is down over 70% from all time highs? And it's actually inversely correlated with one chart. I'll show you guys that later in this video. But as this one chart goes up, this causes Bitcoin to go down. And actually, it's not just Bitcoin. It's all assets across the board. So now you're sitting there thinking to yourself and you're like, hmm, what do I do now? On today's KuCoin DigiDive, I'm gonna be talking about USDC and the stablecoin and how you guys can use it to your advantage and earn a yield, as well as having a chance to earn a share of $250,000 in USDC. I'll go over more details later in this video, but today's video, we're gonna cover how to get a yield on your USDC, where you guys can go, and how to participate in this KuCoin campaign. If you guys wanna stay up to date in the markets, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. And if you wanna get started trading with KuCoin, Links in the description below so you guys can get 20% off trading fees. So let's go and show you guys this chart I was talking about. This has to do with the US dollar chart. This is the Dixie. This represents the dollar against other currencies as well as against other assets. Let's go ahead and take a look and see around 2021. What's ironic around the end of 2021 is when the dollar started ripping. Now, what did Bitcoin start doing around the end of 2021? Well, that's when it started dipping. And as you can see here, we are constantly dipping down, down, and down again. But look at the dollar. The dollar is peaking up and making new all-time highs. As you can see on a one-year chart, it is steadily trending up. And as it's marching up, Bitcoin is marching on the way down. Now you're saying, Drake, 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 hold up. What does this information have to do with anything? Well, what this means is as the dollar is getting stronger and stronger, other assets are getting weaker against it. So how do you hedge your position? Well, hedging would be going into the dollar and holding the dollar instead of other assets. Now, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I'm, I'm not telling you what you should do, but I'm going to show you if you want to hold USDC, this is what you can do. But before I show you a couple of yields you guys can get on USDC, Tell me how you guys are doing in the market. Do you guys think the Bitcoin bottom is in or do we have further to go? Tell me what you guys think in the comments. So this is the tool that I'm using. It's called DeFi Llama. If you want to check the certain yields of a certain token, you just type in that token and select it. I'm going to do USDC and I'm going to look for the highest APYs. I'm going to go ahead and filter by TVL because I don't want to get the junk TVLs like this only has $130,000 in it. And of course, 224,000% APY is a little bit nutty, uh, but then again, I don't want to pair with AVIC token. So we're just going to say Safer Farms about $10 million. Let's go and see what these pools provide. As you can see here, you can provide liquidity for MMF. Me personally, I wouldn't do that. Uh, full, don't know much about it. So I'm going to look for some tokens that I know a little more about. So here you can provide liquidity with the USDC Optimism token you can earn 40%. You can also do Matic and USDC, you can earn 34%, but keep in mind in permanent loss with these things. So what about a single staking deposit? Well, if you go to DeFi rate, you can check out the different rates they're paying for USDC. You got Aave paying 0.34%, Nexo 10%, but remember this is a centralized party. So with Nexo, it's similar to a Celsius situation. If they go bust, your tokens are locked. So always keep this in mind. It's the same thing with BlockFi, you have Coinbase, Compound. So these are some of the blue chip protocols you can use. However, KuCoin also offers a solution as well. So as you can see here, KuCoin has a promotion where you can earn 16% APR. This is almost double the highest you can earn on a single sided rate on USDC. And this is paying over a seven day fixed promotion period, 16% APR. So what this would translate to is if you deposit $1,000 at the end of the year, that would turn into 1160. Now that's not including compounding. This is APR. So if you compound your rewards, it would actually be more than that. So it'd be closer to $1,200. Now this is just the first part of the USDC Autumn Carnival. This campaign is going from September 5th to September 27th. If you're participating in this carnival, you have a chance to join and win a share of $250,000 in USDC. So this would be on top of the rewards you're already getting. Now this is the share of the activity calendar. You're going to have the USDC pop quiz as well as the net deposit campaign. This is going to be the first week from September 5th to September 11th. 
This is for a share of 50,000 USDC. Then you have the trading tournaments, the trading pairs group battle, as well as the guessing battle and win prize for $100,000 in USDC. Then in week three, you have the USDC trading bots, as well as creating different trading bot pairs. And you enjoy a zero fee trading experience during this time frame. And then lastly, to end the celebration is a 16% APR with a seven day USDC fixed promotion rate. So if you guys want to participate in this campaign, make sure you guys fill out this Google form and enter your UID from KuCoin. I'll also leave the details of the event in the description below so you guys can do some research and check it out. Now, if you want to take advantage of the KuCoin earn section, all you do is go under the earn tab right here. And when you select this, you'll be able to search for USDC. During the promotional period, you'll be able to select this and you can earn that 16% yield. And if you're signed up with KuCoin as a new user, you can actually get 100% on your Tether stablecoin for seven days. So right now, as the market is sideways, choppy, and trending downwards, you can protect your capital and protect your assets by sidestepping into a stablecoin. So as the other assets are going down, your value is staying stable. Just make sure you look into the underlying pegging mechanisms for each stablecoin to make sure they are able to hold peg properly. The USDC stablecoin is at over a $50 billion market cap, which means there's over $50 billion in USDC tokens in issuance. Each of these USDC stablecoins are backed by cash or cash derivatives. You can learn more about the USDC token by going to circle.com and researching about their stablecoin. Let's go ahead and hit you guys with a wisdom one-liner. Proverbs chapter 12, verses 11. Those who work their land will have abundant food, but those who chase fantasies will have no sense. Work hard, then you can play hard, man. Again, thanks for tuning in, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this KuCoin DigiDive. If you guys would like to stay up to date and check out some of our previous videos on USDC, as well as some different ways you can earn money on KuCoin, make sure you guys subscribe to the KuCoin YouTube channel. And if you guys would like to get started trading and participate in this campaign and earn your share of the $250,000, make sure you guys go ahead and sign up with KuCoin. Make sure you sign up with KuCoin and enter the campaign. In the description below, we'll give you 20% off trading fees. You can check out some of our previous videos here, here, and like there. We'll see you guys in the next one.